Okay, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to download an image from a web um, location, whether it be your server or somewhere else on the web. Um, we're just going to have a single view application here. We'll um, just call this image download and hit next and create. Okay. I'm going to, I have uh, my little step-by-step -step guide here, which I will share with you. I'm going to add an image view to the storyboard and a button to the storyboard. So I'm going to go into the main storyboard. And let me um, bring my full screen in here. So let's look for an image view. I'll pop that in here. Just make it something like that. I mean, it should, I guess, technically match the dimensions of the image or images that you're going to bring in. Um, but I'm just going to leave it like that for now. And then let's look for a button. And I'll put a button right there. And that's the only two things we're going to use for this demonstration. Um, I'm going to get rid of this little side panel so I have some room here. I'm going to hit the split screen icon there and we're going to create some outlets and one action actually just one outlet and one action so control holding down the control key dropping over here and we'll call this image one and for our button we're going to create an action and we'll call it action one okay we can now get out of split screen. We can go into our view controller dot swift. And let me just take a look at what I have here for us now. So um, we did these first four steps. So my next step is to copy this code right here. And I'm going to put this in our IB action right here. Okay. Oh, this has to be in quotes. Right, and this is giving me an error because I have not built the, um, the methods that are being called. All right, so we're going to add this method here, and I'll explain this code a little more as I add these methods. Okay, so what's happening here is we we have a URL. Um, I have an image of Donald Trump on my uh, Dropbox account and so this is um, getting the URL we are going to uh, pass that URL to a, um, a method called download image and so that's right here uh, there's just a couple prints here to keep you in the loop of what's going on download start it um, it does some things to format the URL and then there's this um, async call that actually does some of the um, actual downloading of the image using um, some NS URL um, methods you know the, that are built into Xcode and one of the things it's doing is uh, it's calling the method get data from URL and I didn't put that method in yet so that's actually the one that has this method here if you notice it has the um, NSURL session that is created, right, and uses the functions there to download. All right, so let's let's fix some of these other errors. The the error we're getting here is because the um, name of our outlet is image one. All right, so that got rid of the errors there. Okay, so most of these errors that you're seeing in here stem from the fact that um, I named my outlet a different name than uh, than I did in the code that I was preparing for this. If I change this to oh, image one, then uh, there should be no more errors. Yep, all gone. So that's it. Those it's basically one, two uh, methods 
and then this is the the call that you make to um, make this happen. Um, let's take a look at make sure this works. I'm going to run this. Uh, I'll just do it in the iPhone 6 emulator, so it's a little smaller than that big iPhone 6 Plus emulator. Okay, so we have a button here. I should be able to click it. There you go. <clears throat> this is some of the um, printouts that I had. Uh, download started and uh, just gave you the path um, right here. Last path component to the actual image. Um, and then download finished here, right? And so it worked, worked pretty well. So, like I said, that was just two methods and a um, we called that method from an IB action where we specified the URL. So in the next video, I'm gonna show you how you can crop this image and just display a part of it. I'm also gonna show, uh, have a, another video that will show you how to um, access insecure images that are not at HTTPSs. So um, I hope you like that. Let me know if you have any questions and uh, please subscribe. Thanks.